In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to use Free Transform in Photoshop, which can be a useful tool for modifying an image. Start Photoshop and have open the image that you want to use the Free Transform tool on. When you are editing photos, the Free Transform tool is particularly effective for working with perspective. As you can see in this photograph, we have an interesting perspective of a tall monument shot from the bottom. To make the image editable, right-click on Background in the Layers panel and click Layer from Background. Click OK in the dialog box that appears. Now, right-click on the image and in the menu that appears, click Free Transform. A bounding box will appear around the image with eight points. You can click on any of these to adjust the image. As well as resizing it, you are also able to change the dimensions of the image. In this example, by making the image narrower, the monument will appear taller than it actually is. To apply the transformation, simply press the Return key. Let's now undo this transformation by pressing Ctrl and Z so we can look at some other elements available as part of the Transform tool. Right-click again and click on Free Transform. The bounding box will appear. Right-click on the image again and you will see several additional options, such as Scale, Rotate and Skew. The use of most of these is obvious and it is worth playing around with the different settings to see what they can do. Here we are going to have a look at Distort, which will allow us to move all of the bounding points individually. It is similar to normal Free Transform, but it gives you a bit more flexibility. If you want to cancel any Free Transform, simply hit the Escape key, as we will do here. Free Transform in Photoshop is a powerful tool, and it is worth playing around with all the different options so that you get to know them well.